Hello and welcome. I am Dr. Ankit Parak and I work as a consultant in pediatric pulmonology, allergy and sleep medicine at Children's Chest Clinic, New Delhi. So in this video, we will talk about a common problem which is allergic conjunctivitis or also commonly known as allergy of the eye. Now as we all know that our eyes are continuously exposed to outside substances like pollution, air and also to substances which are known as allergens. Now these allergens can lead to an allergic reaction in a child or adult who is predisposed to have allergies. And then it leads to an allergic eye or allergic conjunctivitis. Now allergic conjunctivitis can often be associated with other forms of allergies such as allergic nose, also called as allergic rhinitis, atopic skin, also known as atopic dermatitis, and chest allergies, also known as asthma. Now, how do we diagnose allergic conjunctivitis? So, the main clinical symptoms of allergic conjunctivitis, which we often see, are redness of the eye so it becomes more red there can be a clear watery discharge there is usually a lot of itching in the eye there can be a burning sensation in the eye and increased tearing these are the most common clinical manifestations of an allergic eye now these manifestations can be variable in children or adults who have more of pollen allergy these, uh, these allergic features could be in a particular season depending on to what pollen the child is sensitized to. On the other hand, if you have a child or an adult who is sensitized to an indoor allergen, the clinical symptoms of allergic conjunctivitis would be there throughout the year. Now, what investigations are required in children or adults who have allergic conjunctivitis. So usually a good clinical examination is sufficient to make a diagnosis of allergic conjunctivitis. In some situations a detailed examination might be required under a slit lamp. Uh, that is usually performed by our colleagues from ophthalmology or eye surgeons. Now in addition to this to understand to what allergen the person is allergic or what is leading to the allergy, we need to perform allergy test. Now these tests are usually in the form of skin prick test and we have made a detailed video on skin prick test which is available on our YouTube channel. Now in this skin prick test, we test allergens which are there inside the home also known as indoor allergens and these allergens are dust mites, uh, the cat or the dog dander indoor molds for fungus and in addition cockroach. The allergens which are present outside our house or the outdoor allergens are usually pollens of trees, weeds or grasses and they can be variable uh, in relation to the area you reside in in India. Now once we know to what substance the child or the adult is allergic to we can do some precautions and treatment on that. How do we treat a child or an adult with allergic conjunctivitis? Now usually there are two or three things which are commonly used. The most commonly used are ocular lubricant or also commonly known as uh, tear drops. These tear drops soothe the eye, they lubricate the conjunctiva and give relief in tearing, pain, itching and redness. In addition, it dilutes the allergen and also the inflammatory mediators which are released in the eye. The second thing which is extremely useful and commonly used nowadays are dual agents which are a combination of antihistamines and mast cell stabilizers. The most commonly used are olopotadine and bupotastine. Occasionally, some children might require topical steroids like lotiprednol, which we use carefully for a short period. 
there could be some children 